lucky enough to have a mom who would not give up on me. I was suffering with um, trichotillomania for a long time and I've just been hiding it under really big hair bands and wigs for costume parties and just kind of thought that this was going to be my life and then I found out about Pacific Hair and came and was so nervous but when they said that they could help me it was like the best moment. So the hard thing about trichotillomania is that not a lot of people know about it and it's kind of this shameful thing that isn't really out there or known. I mean we're getting better at understanding people's um, behavioral issues, um, some people think it's uh, related to OCD, um, but I think what would help is just more awareness. There's this amazing journal uh, online on YouTube called Trick Journal, T-R-I-C-H-J-O-U-R-N-A-L, Trick Journal, uh, which is fantastic because it's the day in the life of someone suffering with the same thing. And I think just the more we talk about it, the more we embrace it, the less scary it is. Um, and the more times I came back here, I felt better about who I was, what I look like without this. They treat you no different with it on or with it off, and I want everyone to know that. Along with the piece, other things that help me with trichotillomania is keeping my hands busy when you're idle or nervous. So I like to draw. Some people uh, will write down in a journal, do a crossword, play with a pen. Fidget spinners are really big. Talking on the phone, walking around, changing your routine. So usually we're going to do, we're going to pull in the same places all the time. Like on your couch while you're watching TV, in bed when you're nervous about something. So I would just switch it up, have something handy to play with or draw or do in those areas to make it harder for yourself to have idle hands. The hair that they give you is, it, it's actually a barrier, so I can't even get in there to do damage, um, which is really helpful, and it um, helps you curb those cravings to pull. Uh, and also when when you have your maintenance done you can see the progress that's happening and everyone here is really excited for you you can go swimming you can shower with someone and not feel embarrassed you can let people play with your hair and not be scared you don't have to explain oh why are you wearing a hat why are you wearing a hairband this is just yours but it really makes you feel like a woman and it really gives you that confidence back and it's completely for yourself. And it just gives me that extra boost to wake up and not cry in the mirror in the morning is fabulous. And I think everyone that was going through the same thing as me or still is should give it a shot because I'm telling you it's worth it. If you have trichotillomania, you're not alone. Thank you.